we are on the final stretch of the line today at Redcastle Station here, and we're on our way to Muir Voids, which you can, which actually has railway there for a change, rather than just that. So the railway, like mo most good things, could never last forever. So in 1951, it closed to passengers, but remained as a goods line, as it was very important goods-wise. There were many goods sheds along the line, including some of the biggest of which being Och with 30 wagon capacity, Allen Grange with 44 wagon capacity, and Fortress itself with 138 wagon capacity. But then eventually even that wasn't profitable. So nine years later, in 1960, it closed for good. The track was ripped up and that's why we're walking a lost railway and not, I don't know, taking the train. We're approaching Muir Void now. Not much more to go. made it to Muirwood Railway Station. It's taken goodness knows how long, four weeks of filming, but we've made it. If the railway was here now, we wouldn't need to make this video in the first place. Thank you very much to the National Library of Scotland pro for providing a wonderful map that was used through in the making of this film, as well as Rail Scott for its wonderful images and helpful information. Also, big thank you to Jack Kernahan for making his incredible book that helped kickstart this whole project in the first place and give, gave us plenty of information. And thank you to my granddad for just being helpful throughout this entire thing. I wish you all the best. See you soon.